I am here in Riga, Latvia, joined by the lion, Richard Bolotnik. How are you, my friend? Very good, very good. Hey, hey, everyone. Good stuff, man. Um, huge fight coming up uh, against Joshua Buatzi. Um, you're headlining the, the fight camp in, uh, in Essex, in London. Um, you've had two fights drop out um, since you won the MTK Golden Contract. Tell me about some of the frustrations you've had during the last six months. Yeah, what do you mean? Like, um, uh, being unhappy with fights falling through. Uh, you know, already in this year, I have uh, two fights cancelled. Yeah. Yeah, so, and then, boom, Joshua Boat. Uh, <laughs> it's great, it's brilliant. Uh, yeah, I'm happy, of course. It's a big, massive fight. We fight uh, for uh, the belt, the WBA. Uh, yeah, for me, it's, it's massive, massive fight, and I'm happy. And I thought uh, it will be not fa not last fight on this year. I want to f uh, more fights, maybe one, two fights this year too. So, but we're thinking only about 14 of August, week three. Ah, can't fight, can't. So what, um, I know you've looked at Joshua Boatsy before. I know it's been a fight you've been interested in. We're looking for him uh, half an hour or uh, half a year. Yeah. So yeah, we're training five, six uh, months only for him. We, we know sometimes we'll meet uh, each other. So I'm training for him six, five months. Probably. Yeah. Okay, unlucky Joshua. Um, <laughs> um, England, you've been doing very well at beating up British people. Um, you've had great success in England. Um, what are you expecting from your next trip to England? What are you expecting from Joshua Boatsy? Uh, I think it will be my one of uh, the hardest fight, uh, one one of longest. But anyway, I was have a 12 round. Boatsy didn't have so long. Uh, fight, yeah. Uh, I want all 12 rounds. Yeah. Yeah, and I want uh, to really fight. To really, I don't know, to really street fight, boxing fight, everything in this ring, in that day, in that night. You know what I mean? Like, I, wanna, I don't want a one, two, three, four, five round. No. I want to feel everything from, from myself, you know? Yeah. When I will finish the fight and I will come in the dressing room and I was sitting and say, yeah, we did that. You know what <laughs> I mean? I won that fight. Um, obviously, one of your your teammates, uh, Andre Pokemenko, he fought Buatsi once once before. Have you got any tips off Andre about how to deal uh, with Buatsi? No, I think Buatsi is different now. Not was Yeah, before, he's changed so a lot. Anyway, like where everyone... Uh, we changed every fight, so no, no, we're we're looking uh, because only maybe some two, three fights before how he was fighting. Uh, we was looking uh, we fight with uh, Liam Conroy. Yeah, it was a nice fight. Anyway, Conroy is good guy. Uh, but no, about Conroy, I mean, no, it's, I say I, I'm sure the boats are now different way. Yeah. Um. What's really interesting is how far you've improved since I've been commentating on your fights. What What are the main reasons for you becoming such a... Well, you're like a world-ranked boxer now. You're ranked number three in the WBA. My wife, my family. Your wife and your family? Well, of course. I'm fighting only for my wife, for my family, for my mother, my father, my country, my coach. You know, only for my, my family. And money, of and course, money. and money. <laughs> yeah, uh, but then anyway, like uh, you know, I'm not that kind of, kind of guy. Uh, like everyone said, no, 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 no money. We don't need money. Only belts or no. Uh, money, listen, yeah. man, uh, I need to buy the food in uh, you know to uh, to house, and I need to pay house. I need to pay for petrol for cars. Uh, I need to buy some new uh, clothes for my uh, wife to my uh, my parents. Yeah. So of course we're fighting for money. 
my friends, you of course. Uh, but uh, the first, what I was thinking, it's about my family. I'm sitting in the dressing room before a fight, and I think I'm, my my wife watching me, uh, believe in my in my win, and so I need to go out and do my job. Good man, good man. Um, your opinion on how well Latvian boxing is doing? Obviously, a, a few of you guys are doing are going away. Uh, we had Ralphs go to Serbia recently. Um, for such a small country, how does it have so many good boxers? What is there, 1.8 million people in Latvia? And we have about 50 professional boxers. What, why is that? Uh, it's like, uh, I need to say like, big country, small country, wherever. Like, we need to be the big guys, the big people. Uh, big strong people with with uh, big hearts and with families and with some good good thinking minds and whenever like you know what I mean like, if uh, that's a small country but we are here we are strong guys yeah. and we show that and we prove that yeah and um, obviously this fight I know you're thinking about Joshua Boazzi but. If you do win this, what next? Yeah, there's talks of Bivol. I think you'll be in line for the WBA title and things like that. Is it is it hard to stay focused on Joshua Boazzi with all these uh, these big prizes available after uh, after? My friend, I'm thinking now only about uh, my training after 20 minutes. Yeah. You're... So I'm uh, thinking about what I do now, and I'm thinking only about 14 of August. And what will be have in the future? No, uh, I don't want to do. I don't want to think about that. Of course, I think about world title and about WBC and WBO and WBA and IBF and all the belts. What I want, yeah. My wife like uh, WBC, the green one. Yeah, but that's <laughs> really? it's the future. Yeah, but anyway, like so. Um, yeah, now now we need to do our job in. August 14, and then the God will help us, and we will go forward. Yeah. Um, uh, obviously, you've got MTK Global there on your on your T-shirt. Um, you must be very happy with them getting this getting this help getting this fight for you. Yeah, of course, they all the all time help us, and all time uh, now after December when I won uh, when I win uh, the final, they were trying to help me, Lee, ah, my friend. Uh, yeah, they all time to help us and to the text and our managers, my managers, Vadim Milov and Evgeny Sapanenko, all time kind of uh, like text each other, connecting. So, yeah, yeah, of course, I'm sure uh, this fight with was they helped me too. Like, you know, yeah. like, of course. And uh, what we'll what we'll end on, um, you've been uh, you're blessed with uh, good sparring partners in. Riga itself, uh, you've got a lot of guys in and around your weight. Um, are you still working with uh, the likes of Bradis yeah, and yeah. things? And he's in the gym now. He's in the gym now. Yeah, is yeah, he? he's in the gym now, and we have a training now uh, together. We're training now together every every second day because yep. we have one coach, yeah, uh, Dmitry Shekhalai. So we're training together. Of course, we're different weights, but. Uh, some 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 jobs we can do together, and he's like my big brother, like he all time to help me. Give me the head. Ah, come on, really? come on, young, come on, <laughs> like working, a working, yeah, like working, working, like you know. Uh, it's good, it's good. I growing up and uh, make more experience with that kind of champion. You know, I mean, like uh, happy uh, when he's uh, beside me. So. Yeah, and now we have a good uh, sparring partner as well. They will come from Ukraine, from Russia, and, uh, from everywhere, from here, the same. So I'll be ready. I'll be ready. Good man. Good man. Um, I think we'll leave it there. Oh, no, there was one question I wanted to ask you, actually. Um, you told me in one of our first interviews um, that the reason you started boxing was with because of seeing Neris Bradis on the is, TV. Uh, be, must yeah. be crazy that you're now training with him every yeah. other day. Uh, uh, mm, yeah, yeah. 
because of him, yeah, we start and now we're training together. But no, I think I don't want to say that, but maybe I start to be good. <laughs> so he can train with me as well. But no, of course, we have one coach, that's why we're training together, yeah? And uh, we don't do some some hard jobs, uh, like with inspiring, no, 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 just with bags or running or swimming, some something like that. We can't, like, uh, training, uh, we, we can't do uh, everything together because we're different uh, skills, different movements, different ways. And so mm. anyway, that. Very interesting. Uh, Richard, wish you nothing but success in uh, Essex and thank you very much for talking to Pro Boxing fans. Hey everyone, watching August 14, Balotin Guazzi, boo boo. <laughs> so it will be massive fight, my friends, and we'll show the greatest fight.